swiftly. Oh, finally a decently sized mirror, and it is all shattered? Unfortunately, this mirror is not about seeing your outsides. It's about seeing what's inside of you. Can't we just look through the hole in my belly? Hmm. <sighs> well, all right. Let's do this then. Gael, I remember you talked about being an avid letter writer in your past. Yet I only ever saw you writing poems to yourself. You know, I think it is time for you to continue your correspondence, don't you? What? How would you? You dared reading my letters, Mordecai? Turn from the dead to the undead, and I will make you wish you never even died before. Canoness, the message has ended. Hmm. The Torta. Well, I'd better get to my secret stash, I suppose. Secret stash, eh? Yes. It is on Calamity Reef. There lies the Brine Razor, and all the wreckage grounded there since the battle. I hid some of my belongings in it. It seems I need to get them back. As you command. Set a course, Captain. There she is, the Brine Razor. Looks like the Inquisition is interested as well. They might have found your stash already. Ah, no, I'm not worried about that. Really? Because they've got that ship covered pretty well. Yes, look. See that gun on there? They didn't even touch it yet. That's where you put your things? Of course. Cannons are great for storing valuables. <laughs> yeah, that's definitely true. Now we just have to get to it and shoot it. Allons-y, Ephia. Choose our landing. Of course. It's about time. <laughs> if you wish. What's in it for me? Well, well. Straight to the point. <laughs> A sword of the heart. Uh, heavy. Oh. There shouldn't be footprints here. Little death bringer. I like the course you chop. Heave ho. Free. Your soul is free. Let's get you somewhere else. I like it already. I like these arms. Whoa. Uh, heavy. Consider it done. I'm holding it. 
Let's get you somewhere else. Always move forward. I'm losing track of time. Hi. Something strange is in the air. From here to there. Now we're getting somewhere. Let's send them on the way. Top. See you around, friend. Heave ho! It's been a while. Ah. Let's get you somewhere else. Unsh. Oh. One less to worry about. Welcome to the other side. Now we're getting somewhere. I like it already. There's no distance. Don't let the flame get you. Ugh, heavy. Consider it done. Ready for a challenge. Swiftly. Dear Trihu, I know it has been some time. Ah, no, no. Are you writing something in your head? It's... well, I'm thinking of writing something at least. Yes. So, what's in that cannon? Ink and parchment? Close. Through the below. It's a stack of letters, written between me and the... a, a pen. Straight to the point. D'accord. <laughs> Never look back. I. Oi. Oui. Must be a mistake. What happened? Happy. He's better. Simply they were wanting. Why not? Let's see what's that. out. Cruel twist of fate, perhaps. Always move for, for a reason. It was meant to be, I suppose. Nothing My to My body fades. Is that? I'll be there soon. <laughs> Let's get you somewhere else. Well, well. Glad you have a no second thoughts. You got grave ho. I'll hold on to what is mine. Opportunity calls. I'm holding it. You stand on top of this ship while it's burning. It is our order. One less to worry. Uh, heavy. Any cannons loose? Swiftly. You're survive. Barely. Find his keepers. Right. Oh, I like these odds. See you in the afterlife. This place. Oh. It gives me the shivers. Controls. Don't him. let the flame get you. The maiden Let's get you somewhere else. I. My chest uh, is heavy. off limits. What's in it for me? Hook, line, and sinker. Always move. Heave ho. The flame has been drawn. Anything shiny? Ever. If there is that, the wood is mine. Curse oh, one legendary ship. Let's get moving, eh? I do not know of anything else that can resist the flame that long. At 
at your service. Oui. Bonjour. Let's see what's up. You know I was never good at making apologies, Trivo. Ah! Right like that. You know I was never good at... What oh. do we have here? Are Consider you still thinking of that letter? Ugh. Oh, I'm just putting words next to each other like a literate toddler. I don't remember ever seeing you struggling to what write, Canoness. Me neither. Nobody takes yours mine! <laughs> Tough customer. Opportunity calls. Little death bringer. <laughs> See you around, friend. Now we're getting somewhere. Let's unshackle your soul. This place. We're all cut loose here. Control your nerves, <coughs> Acolyte. The maiden. I miss the way your soul is free. Enjoy. Let's not ask for permission. What do we have here? I. The cannon is mightier than the sword. Swiftly. The fire near rivals the pit of Iron Bay. Yep. We may come back. He's a magnificent conflagration, isn't he? My soul is razor sharp. I like long shots. Got it. What's next? Ah, you still pack a punch. Thank you very much, my dear. It shot my package right out in the open. Let's go and grab it. I stand ready. I like these arts. Always move forward. No second thoughts, eh? Let's Don't sell me short. It's a deal then. They can't resist. Well now, what do we have mm. here? <gasps> Nobody abandons Is their that... post. There shouldn't be footprints here. I can smell gold already. At your service. Never look back. Let's get you somewhere. Golden else. greeting. Hook, line, and sinker. Ready for a challenge. I'll hold on to what is mine. My soul is razor sharp. Cast for treasure. Swiftly. Is there treasure? An offer I can't refuse. My head is loose. What's in it for me? I'm holding it. See you around, friend. 
Long shots. My chest is off limits. Finders keepers, right? Ready to fire. Where the wind blows, cannonballs oh, fly. Ducker. The letters. They're still all there. That's a hefty bundle. All just between you and your pen pal, eh? Well, it's only the ones I chose to keep. I don't think I've written half that much in my entire life. Uh, once you've found someone to correspond with, the words will usually just write themselves. But enough of that. Let's get back to the Marley first. Let's get moving, eh? Now we're getting somewhere. The Atreyu. Today I went back to the Brine Razor and picked up your letters. I hid them in a cannon as you always did with your things. It worked, of course. The Zealots are too narrow-minded to look for treasures anywhere else than... <laughs> My suppose I'll have to read through them once again. Bisou, Gael. So what's this test of yours about? I just composed a letter to my former pen pal. Former, eh? Yes. She, well, we used to be close. Very close. You know, it was like all my secrets belonged as much to her as they belonged to me. If that makes any sense. I can imagine. So how come you're not pen pals anymore? Well, when I became undead, I found that was finally something that I was afraid to tell her. So you haven't seen her since? Seen? No, no, I've never seen her. We've only written letters to one another. Did you ever plan to meet each other then? You know, I always imagined visiting her at some point. From the treasure I'd amassed, we could buy ourselves a little orchard and drink seed. In the evening sun. But these are dreams of the past. Memories I must let go in order to look forward again. Memories to let go. Hmm. So in my letter I've apologized for not contacting her. And told her that this will be the last one. I hope with that she'll gain the closure I denied her until now. Well if you think that's what's best for you. Where are we heading next? I need someone to deliver my letter all the way to France. We'll find him in Angler's Grave. Bien sûr. Bien sûr. Set a course, Captain. arrived, Canoness. Now, are you certain that someone here is willing to deliver that letter for you? Willing? Ah! Unlikely. But he'll go, I'm sure of it. Do you know where he resides? He lives right here, in the slums. I suppose we just go there and knock on the door. Exactement, Ephia. Now, our landing, if you will.
me at him. Of course. Standing around, catching light. Yeah, let me at him. <laughs> Kid'll only hurt a bit. <laughs> Kill the body. Up, up we go. Watch me go. I'll trim their numbers. <laughs> Food for the vines. Oh, this is fascinating. Oh? Your oh, strength is very good. I rigid. gotcha. I can respect that, Sule. Oh, no problem. Oh. No more business. Huh? You've got guts, pirate. Just these shots. I stand against the tempest. Bien sûr. At your service. Hey, hey, I am Tisse. You there? Gael? Is that you? <laughs> it's been a while, huh? It has. Do you want to open the door, maybe? Hmm. Depends on what you want. I need you to carry a letter for me again. One last time. Ah, oh, Gael, you know I'm not strictly a messenger. Eh oui, you're a smuggler. You've always used these trips as a front to get some artifact out of the Lost Caribbean. So, what do you want? Ah, you know me too well, Gael. Well, it's, it's only a small favor, as usual. The Inquisition knows all my disguises, so... Deposit a guard in my backyard, and I'll do the rest, huh? And some cedra as well, perhaps. Hey, if you don't mind. I do, very much. Give me a minute. I'll get you your disguise. How long has it been? D'accord. <laughs> there you go, Aramtis. A simple acolyte? What do you take me for? A man who has run out of disguises and is trapped in his little shack on the outskirts of Angler's grave? Well, but... But the acolytes lack authority. I'll be questioned immediately. Please, bring me a commissarius, huh? I swear, if you're just sending me around to entertain yourself... Uh, you know I'd never annoy you on purpose, guy. Now we're getting somewhere. <laughs> Heave ho! I like it already. I miss the waves under my feet. Let's get moving, eh? Any cannons loose? Opportunity calls. A sword to the heart. Wash one. One less to worry about. Ah, that is perfect. Just give me a moment. The trousers are a bit tight. 
Please, take your time. It's not like this town is sprawling with Inquisition zealots. At your command. Sure as a stop. Ah, that suits me nicely. Now there's just one more thing. I don't have any seed. No, 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 no. I need you to carry me to my warehouse. I've got some things I need to pick up there. Your warehouse, eh? And why do I have to carry you around if you're already disguised? Well, first of all, I don't know anything about their current right of patrol. Sure. And the warehouse? It's in the middle of the harbor, uh, and it contains items that I'd like to take to France with me. Well, just know it'll be a pretty rough ride. <laughs> How bad can it be? I've seen you use your cannon. I'm sure I can handle it. As you command. your service. Straight to the point. <laughs> your help is appreciated. Strange. Is it the weather? It's oh, I see. Oh, Don't I like see. that. I know right where to cut. I have just the thing. So, if she writes back, where do I find you? I don't think she'll respond. I'll be there ah, soon. I see. And I presume that means you won't write any more letters to her either. Since when are you interested in my personal guidance? Just for planning purposes. Well, you'll have to plan without me in the future. A crack in the glass. I like long shots. Oh, I can grow lots of things. Whoa. Where the wind blows, oh. cannonballs fly. I've heard news from Madrid. What ails your soul today? Strange. Treatment's ready. Up, up we go. I do oh. like this so far. Three little cuts. <clears throat> huh. Oh, no problem. What do we have here? Is that? Conditions are collide. We must uncover them. No second thoughts, eh? Remedies for the dead. I gotcha. Too many weeds here. Do you plan to end your relationship with Piru because of the curse? What are you talking about? Oh, come on, Gael. I'm a thief, not an idiot. There were times I couldn't even hang my coat on the wall before you had finished your reply. But since you got that hole in your belly, you... You haven't talked about her once until now. Duh. Perhaps it... it would be a pity, you know, considering how passionately you wrote to each other. You saying that you read my letters too? What do you expect me to do? Sailors are boring, and the trip takes forever. If there was anybody else who'd be willing to go, I'd shoot you into the ocean right here and now. I Let's know, not ask Asheri. for permission. I know. Ah, let's stretch those roots. <laughs> Vines are all over my arm.
All right, should be easy fix. Here. The maiden waits for Never no look back. Be careful. They're on your side. Where is Straka here? Let's get you somewhere else. J'écoute. Quelle surprise. Ah, my soul is razor sharp. I like it already. I'm holding it. <coughs> Your soul is free. Enjoy. I like these odds. Unshackled. <coughs> Welcome to the other side. I. Through the bay. <coughs> See you around. For <coughs> heavy. Straight to the point. <laughs> There's no distance. One less to worry about. Heave ho! Consider it done. Time chicanery. Let's get you somewhere else. No second thoughts, eh? Let's capture this moment in time in case our plan fails. Now we're getting somewhere. <laughs> Like that. Never look back. Working on it. Oh. Don't let the zealots catch you. Next pay up, up we go. Mm -hmm. The cannon is mightier than the sword. Always me. Ah, I have just the thing. Food for the vine. Oh, no problem. Opportunity call. Ah, très difficile. I like long shots. Wash one. Swiftly. Let's not ask for permission. Who wants to get shot, eh? Sure as a stops. Do you remember? Hold on tight. It's going to be bumped. I think I was mistaken. Bien sûr. Quel surprise! Strange. As you come on. <laughs> I. Is that? Say, Gael, what do you think Trihu looks like? You know I never cared for her that way. It's her mind and her letters that I'm interested in. 
And how do you think she'd answer that question if I asked her? That's different. Different how? It's different because I'm dead. Vraiment. Because you know from what I've seen, you are still you, Kyle. Sure, you are soul-infused and inhumanly strong, but at heart, you're still yourself. <laughs> My heart hasn't been beating for years. But your soul is still there, isn't it? Don't you have things to collect here? Oh yes, loads. Just give me a moment, please. Ta. Okay, got it all. There's a small boat in the harbor. Uh, take me there and I'll be off. Let me remind you. Ah, let's stretch those roots. Oh, this is fascinating. Oui. D'accord. I can't do this. Bonjour. Out with you. Oh, oh, too much rum. Let's not ask for permission. There we are. Now I just need the letter. I don't think it's finished yet. I see. Then I suppose we'll meet each other in New Crockbury. You still get your passage from there? Eh, old habits die hard. Meet at the old spot? D'accord. See you there. Aye. Never look back. Welcome to the other side. I can now now work this connected. gives me the shivers. Ready to ride. The drawing board, it seems. Damn you, Iantis. Let's not ask for permission. Dear Trio, I heard it once said that all beginnings are hard. Today, I believe second beginnings are even harder. But after avoiding contact for years, I don't want to prevaricate anymore. I've avoided writing to you, because I died. Your letter is coming along? Uh, yes, just give me a bit of time. Uh, and ready. I think that'll do just fine. I need to get to New Crockbury, and I'd like to go there alone, Marley. I'll have a dinghy ready for you whenever you please. Quelle surprise! D'accord! Where to, Captain? Let me out, it is so boring here. You are accused of the impersonation of a commissarius. While the maiden bids us all to show mercy, these charges represent the highest order of crime. Now, once again, do you confess? Let me think. No, I don't. <sighs> So much for a nice relaxing stroll along the beach. Should I send more crew? No, thank you. I'll get him out myself. Hmm. It seems that his ship is stuck in a dead calm just outside the harbor. 
Luckily, that looks like a manageable distance to me. Still wearing the uniform. That is true. Yet that thing. Bien sûr. D'accord. I will get you. Anti-Saltis. Why even bother with a disguise if they catch you anyway? Well, at least this exercise will be somewhat entertaining. You're so rare enough that we get to be out here by ourselves. Sure, it's a stop. Let's not ask for permission. Is appropriate. A little spectacle, just for you. As you come up. <laughs> ah, I would have forgotten otherwise. I. Let's not ask for permission. You all have our place in the design. I like long shots. Hmm? Ha! So... Little bombs. Let... You are charged with the like moth to the firecracker of a commissaris. Swifter, I do resist the noise. But I must insist that I've been badly framed. I'm innocent. This, this is, is going to be a long shot. The right have been shot. I will not show off. You can't be. Going to ha, 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 ha! a fine shot. Ducker are still with I. I like long shots. Huh? Stay safe. <laughs> As you come up. Hmm. Have you ever considered the consequences of your actions? You've interfered with the grand design. Oh, really? I didn't yes. notice it one bit, to be Boy. honest. Huh? 
what do we Continue have here? your grandstanding and the maiden will judge you here and now. Please. Please. I see. You have heard your charges. Do you confess? I'm afraid I didn't listen. <laughs> Sure, as a story. Finally, there you are. Oh, I was afraid I had to get out of here on my own. Ah, I would have liked to see you try. Ah, you've got a letter for me, or is this just a rescue mission? Here it is. Very good. And how do I get on the trading vessel? I paid for my passage, <laughs> but uh, I don't think they'll turn back to harbor just for me. Ah, they won't have to. I have my gun. Ah, well, all right. Time is moving fast. Remember the dead. <laughs> Wash one. <laughs> hmm. Let's be quiet, friend. I. Quelle surprise oh. hmm? You're a rare sight. Strange. Let's not ask for permission. Path. Not my problem. Oh. I like long shots. Huh? Stick it to the zealots. Ah! Bien sûr. The landing could be a bit rough. I need ammunition. Et les canons. Quelle surprise! Provided me with ample to read on this arduous journey. What? Uh, nothing. <laughs> I think the breeze is picking up. Looks like we're lifting anchor. Goodbye. I dare you, Antis. If you break that seal, I'll. Oh, I'm sorry. The wind is carrying your voice away. Goodbye, Gael. Goodbye. Uh, take care, you damn cretin. Hmm, now, my dear Gael, let's see what you've put together here. Dear Trio, I heard it once said that all beginnings are hard. Today I believe second beginnings are even harder. But after avoiding contact for years, I don't want to prevaricate anymore. I've avoided writing to you, because I died. As I've written before, here in the Lost Caribbean, that means something different. It may be hard to believe, but I've got a huge hole in my belly and I permanently carry a cannon on my back. The cannon, however, will only shoot people. Also, I'm arguably immortal. For a long time, it was hard to imagine any kind of future together. And to be honest, it still is. But I think it was wrong to not at least include you in this discussion. I hope you can forgive me. It has been a long while, but if you're still interested in having a pen pal, I'd be happy to hear from you. Bisous, Gael. Oh, how heartwarming. Mm. Oh, there's something on the back as well. P.S. 
Please check the seal of this letter carefully. If it seems to have been tampered with, give Aramtis a solid knock on the head for me. Oh, Gam. Um, does anybody here happen to have any wax? There is not much more I can do. I will have to look at the mirror again. Daka! Feel better now? Wish. Think she'll reply? <laughs> I would be surprised if she does. Doesn't seem to bother you. You look... happy. Or at least happier. Let me face the mirror again and see if it agrees. It worked? Indeed it did. Well done, Canoness. Thank you, Marley. Thank you, Ephir. I'm glad. Well, I'll get back to work. If you want to talk sometime, be my guest. Walsh one! 